السلام عليكم مستر بريزيدنت allow me a few minutes from your highness time with all my respect this video is my personal contribution in trying to deliver to your highness the great news of arriving of the seventh planet from the statement of the holy quran but first i would like to thank you for your historic and fair speech at the Islamic Society of uh, Baltimore. Thank you for condemning hateful rhetoric and violence against everyone, and for your refusal uh, to give legitimacy to all criminal uh, groups uh, like ISIL uh, to represent uh, Islam. As it's absolute truth, uh, they do not represent Islam in any aspect at all. They are working in a true so hard uh, to distort the image of uh, Islam. I'm not American, but uh, we are grateful uh, for that. America is lucky uh, to have wise president uh, like you. Uh, Mr. President, uh, the statement I'm trying uh, to deliver uh, was written to your highness uh, since uh, 2009. And it includes scientific and astronomical uh, facts and the great warning regarding uh, the coming uh, great promised event. Uh, NASA scientists, uh, Mr. President, as it's uh, promised in the Holy Quran, are from those who have uh, the scientific vision to confirm these facts and the coming uh, event. Uh, by now, they know that this planet orbiting our Earth uh, from its bull's uh, side means it's uh, coming from the lower space into Earth uh, above space with an orbit angle of about 45 uh, degree and this is uh, the exact description in the Holy Quran uh, Mr. President, uh, the coming pass for this planet is a promised event in the Holy Quran the planet will not hit uh, Earth, but it will be very close, uh, so it will force Earth uh, to rotate in its uh, reverse uh, direction, causing uh, bulls uh, shift, so the sun will rise uh, from the west. Uh, when it will arrive into Earth upper space, it will uh, rain fire stones. Uh, these stones will shaped and capable uh, of crossing the atmospheric uh, shield of uh, the upper stratosphere. Uh, now, uh, maybe Mr. Charlie Bolden, uh, current NASA administrator, uh, want to interrupt me and say, Yes. We know the facts of the seventh planet existence and its orbit angle. It's exact as it's mentioned in the Holy Quran, but we didn't announce this officially. Then how do you claim to know that we have discovered these facts? Uh, then I will answer you, uh, sir, uh, with all respect, uh, Mr. Bolden. Uh, that I'm claiming uh, nothing. Uh, this is uh, true as uh, written in the Holy Quran in clear verses that you will discover uh, the facts of uh, this planet uh, existence and you will know it's approaching uh, toward Earth. Uh, but you couldn't calculate uh, the exact uh, appointment uh, date for its uh, arriving. As it's uh, promised, it will arrive uh, suddenly. Uh, there are uh, too many astronomical uh, facts in the Holy Quran, uh, sir. For example, it's written that you will discover uh, the Big Bang. Uh, also, regarding the stars, uh, supernova events in the space. But if you allow me, sir, I would like to ask you if you can explain to us how the moon now becomes uh, full in uh, many months uh, before uh, the 14th of uh, the lunar calendar. Well, we still cannot explain this phenomenon.
from the statement, we learned uh, the scientific explanation uh, for current moon uh, phenomena, uh, and it's a great sign for the arriving of uh, the seventh uh, planet. Uh, now, maybe Mr. President uh, Obama want to say. We have very good background about Islam, but we never heard anything about the seventh planet from any Muslim scholar before. From time to time there are always someone claiming the awaited Mahdi identity. How can we be sure that Imam Nasr Muhammad al is the true awaited Mahdi and the savior of mankind from the coming torment? Then I will answer you, Mr. President, that uh, this is the way we know the true identity of uh, the awaited man, as no one else in have his uh, knowledge uh, from the Holy Quran. Uh, he is the one who having the full knowledge of uh, the book, so he clarified the scientific and logical facts of uh, the Holy Quran from its uh, clear uh, verses. I would like also to tell you, Mr. President, that the awaited uh, Mahdi Imam Nasir Muhammad had announced uh, the exact location for Mr. Al Masih, peace and the face uh, be upon him, but and it's in Al Yemen. And we believe uh, Your Highness uh, can verify that. Uh, I thank you very much, uh, Mr. President, for your time and peace uh, be upon him.